Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Love Charms World. Welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, that like button, tell a friend to tell a friend. And I love you guys so, so, so much, so much, so much for watching. I hope you love my content. So by the title, you already know what this topic is going to be about. So yes, I'm doing another sit down video. I'm currently in my hotel room had a very long day today very long i had a 12 hour shift today and i am beat i just took a shower and i'm like let me just do this video real quick for you guys um yeah so let's get right into it shall we mm -hmm. so i actually wrote these down like ridiculous questions in which um passengers ask some of them are not really ridiculous but some of them are funny and some are just like, what, you know? Yeah, so if you're a flight attendant and what are some ridiculous questions that passengers have ever asked you? And what was your reaction? Comment down below, comment down below and let's get this on and pop in. I specifically remember this one where a passenger rang the bell again ding dong went up to them so this we're currently in flight and then um it's a couple so then the wife asked me um she's like she goes um do you know where we're flying over and i'm like um i'm sorry i don't i don't know where we're flying over and then she goes you should know and her husband looked at her and i'm like how how should i know how should I know? In my head, I'm like, how should I know where we're flying over? Like, I don't walk around with a map on the aircraft saying, oh, ladies and gentlemen, we're flying over. Da, da, da. Like, you know what I mean? I was just like, when she said, you should know, I was just like, what? I should know? I know on some aircraft, when they have the screens and everything, sometimes it would show like when they're flying over a specific area but i cannot tell you where specifically we're flying over like my job is here my job is literally here to serve you and protect you in case of an emergency i'm here for an emergency really like how am i supposed to know where we're flying over i don't know that was just kind of ridiculous to me and i was just like what you know <laughs> so i was doing my research on like some really ridiculous stuff that flight attendants get asked and this one i came across this one i'm gonna read it to you guys she was like um i was about two hours into flight i went over and i was like can i help you ma'am and she was like are we moving so like they're two hours into the flight you know because i guess because you're like way up and they're all they're seeing is clouds so it may seem like they're not moving she's like she goes i didn't really have an answer because i've never had that question before but evidently that's a thing so i guess it's a thing that um flight attendants get asked you know and she said i wish i had a clever comeback because i was just kind of thrown off Ma'am, we've been in the air for like two hours. No, we're just, she was like, no, we're just hovering. We're just going to wait until the earth rotates, rotates and land. I'm like, I'm just like, what? You know, but I get how they could think that we're not moving. Cause like, you're just passing like a lot of clouds. So you're just like, what are we moving? You know? That was funny to me. We're delayed. The captain comes on, make an announcement. And then as soon as he, as he makes his announcement, they ring the button, you go to them and you're like, why are we delayed? Why are we delayed? And then they start cussing you out. I remember this happened to me when I first started. The captain legit just told us why we're delayed and you ring the bell and ask me again why we're delayed do you think i'm going to say something else different from what the captain is gonna say like i honestly don't know like i honestly don't know or when they're they're um about to when they're about to get off the aircraft and they're like am i gonna make my connection 
and now with our with our app on um with our app now on our phone we could see um where they who's connecting and where their gate is and everything and some of them is like rushing like crazy like i remember one time I, we landed and um we were running a little, little late so we said passengers flying on such and such um no we said let me rephrase we said if you are staying in such and such state or if you have a longer layover please can you remain seated so that the other passengers with tight connection can come forward so that they could try and catch their connecting flight and i remember this passenger had a long layover and rushing to the front rushing oh my god oh my god i miss my connection i miss my connection and i'm just like where are you going they say such and such and i'm like you have a three hour layover how how tell me how how are you going to miss your connection how please tell me and i'm just like you guys i don't know i always say i feel like when packs are going through TSA that they I don't know it's like a vacation attitude like they forget things or stuff like that or um when they come on board and have hefty pe people that could lift their own bags like look stronger than me um can you help me with my bags please their bag is heavy as hell first of all um i just found out that we're not supposed technically we're not supposed to be helping passengers lift their bag we're supposed to assist we're not supposed to put it in by ourselves because if something should happen to us and we call the insurance and we should get like short-term disability we can't say we were helping the passengers lifting your bag because we're technically we're not supposed to do that we're supposed to assist but we're not supposed to like physically take the whole thing and put it in ourselves. you know what i mean i'm not gonna say i don't help if it's like older people or you know somebody that really can't assist themselves i will help but sometimes you'll be packing your bag heavy as hell and want me to lift it and you look way like you look like you can lift it way better than i can i can't help you i can't help you i'm sorry i you shouldn't you should have known the bag would have been heavy before you packed it so yesterday a passenger came on board and then they're like i saw them sitting in first class but on our app we could see who is sitting in first class and who shouldn't so then i'll went up to them I'm like excuse me um can I see your boarding pass please and then they're like oh our seat is at 15b and um we couldn't find it so you decided to sit in first class so you just just sit anywhere like you cannot do that guys guys I have to say this you can't just come on and um just sit where you want to sit like when other passengers come on board and you're in their seats you know they get a little irritated and they, you know what i mean and start causing confusion because i remember once a passenger passengers got into arguments over seats you know what i mean we're trying to avoid that we want a smooth sailing boarding and um uh another thing is when you come on board and if you see some seats are empty um ask before you place yourself there because more sometimes those seats are like upgrade seats and we can't just automatically automatically i can't pronounce that word listen don't 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 judge me we can't we can't just upgrade you you know what i mean you have to pay for it and you have to speak to the gate agent about that we cannot do anything about seating you have to speak to the gate agent about seating we don't know nothing about it we just want to see your boarding pass where your seat is and and that's it we don't know we don't know why you didn't get upgraded like nothing like that or when uh it's like the holidays and they come on board like oh my god you're working they have you working on the holidays 
yeah if you didn't buy your ticket then we wouldn't be here in the first place like some of them are just so hilarious to me guys like this some of them are so funny to me it's the questions that were being asked or sometimes on our plane on our flights um when it's a certain mileage we only do coffee and water right coffee water tea and snacks right so i'll be walking through hi would you like any coffee or water tea and they'll be like can i have a coke please and i'm like we only have coffee water and tea can i have a coke please and i'm like i'm sorry we only have coffee water and tea and they're like oh i'm sorry never mind or when they're like when I walk through and I'm like, would you like, and they're like, I ask what they want. And then you're like, coffee, black. And then you give them the black coffee and then you're like, oh ma'am, I needed cream and sugar. So technically it's not black. How is it black if you need cream and sugar to put in there? Like, just let me know. Maybe I didn't go to school and know the colors properly, but I don't know. Maybe it's a new, a new shade. <laughs> I just, just this camp. I'm walking through the cabin and I go up to someone and then I'm like, can I get you something to drink? And they're like, yes, please. And then I'm like, what would you like to drink? They're like, what do you have? And then I list everything. And then they're like, oh, water. And I'm just like, hmm. I listed all of that for you to just say water okay okay here's your water <laughs> anyways guys that's the end of the video it's pretty short today I know but it's kind of it's like almost 1 a.m. and I'm super uber duper tired so I'm just trying to do this video real quick for you guys I'm trying to be very um what's the word what's the word what's the word that word <laughs> Oh my god consistent is the word i'm trying to be consistent for you guys on this channel i hope that you like it if you do like it hit that like button hit it hit it hit it hit it and if you're new to my channel or if you're a returning person if you're returning why haven't you subscribed yet i'm gonna sit and wait we're trying to get to 1k subscribers guys hit that subscribe button um thank you guys so much for watching i love you guys so much for watching i hope that you enjoy the rest of your weekend and comment down below ridiculous questions someone may have asked you for you to double take and be like what or if you're a crew member just comment down below and let me know what are some ridiculous questions that a passenger have asked you for you to be like say what now anyways hope you guys enjoy Love you for watching and enjoy the rest of your evening. Bye.